Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is 8 power of x plus 4 power of x is equal to 36. To find the value of x from this equation. Now, from here, 8 power of x, 8 is same as 2 power of 3, then bracket this power of x, then plus 4 power of x, 4 is same as 2 power of 2, then bracket this power of x, is equal to this 36. Then in the next step, from here, we'll exchange the powers. This power of x inside, power of 3 outside. Also in here, power of x inside, power of 2 outside. So into here, it will be 2 power of x inside the bracket, then this power of 3 outside the bracket, plus 2 power of x inside the bracket, then this power of 2 outside the bracket is equal to this 36. Then in the next step, from here 2 power of 3, I mean 2 power of x is common. So we'll let y is equal to 2 power of x. Then it will be y power of 3. So here y power of 3 then plus y power of 2. So y power of 2 is equal to 36. Then into here we'll take this 36 to the left side. So it will be y power of 3 plus y power of 2, this will take to this side, so it will be minus 36 is equal to 0. Then it will be y power of 3 plus y power of 2. This minus 36 will split according to these two exponents. So minus 36 is same as minus 27 minus 9 is equal to 0. Then it will be y power of 3 plus y power of 2 minus 27 into exponent it is 3 power of 3 minus 9 into exponent it is 3 power of 2 is equal to 0 then from here we place with the like power of 3 together so it will be it will, it will be y power of 3 then this minus 3 power of 3 then plus this y power of 2 minus this with power of 2 so minus 3 power of 2 is equal to 0 then in the next step from here, this part here, y power of 3 minus 3 power of 3, this is in the form of a perfect cube. So we'll apply the rule in this form. So therefore, we'll apply the rule which is into this form. It is a power of 3 minus b power of 3 is equal to a minus b bracket bracket a square plus a b plus b square bracket then from here into this part here it is in the form of a perfect square so we'll apply perfect square rule here here therefore we'll apply a perfect square rule which is a square minus b square is equal to a minus b bracket times a plus b bracket now by from this part here by applying this rule, we'll apply this form here. So a minus b, a minus b, it will be y, y minus 3. So here, it will be y minus 3, bracket, then bracket, a square, it will be y square. So here, y square, then plus ab, it will be y times 3 is 3y, three then plus b square it will be 3 square which is 9 bracket then this plus into this part here we'll apply this rule here of a perfect square into this form so a minus b it will be y minus 3 so here bracket y minus 3 bracket bracket a plus b it will be y plus 3 so here y plus 3 bracket then is equal to this 0 then in the next step, from here, y minus 3 is common. So we'll take y minus 3 bracket out of bracket. Then this here, divided by y minus 3, it is this quadratic expression, which is y square plus 3y plus 9. Then this plus, this part here, divided by y minus 3, it will be this part here of y plus 3. So here it is y plus 3 bracket is equal to 0. 
then in the next step it will be y minus 3 bracket bracket this y square then plus 3y plus y it is 4y plus 9 plus 3 it is 12 bracket is equal to 0 then from here we have two solutions whereas this first solution which is y minus 3 is equal to 0 and this second solution which is y square plus 4y plus 12 is equal to 0 then from this part here we will take negative 3 to this side so it will be y is equal to 3 now we are not supposed to find y the value of y we're supposed to find the value of x so we we'll recall before we let y we we'll recall but y it is this 2 power of x so here y it is 2 power of x then we'll compare these two equations so it will be 2 power of x is equal to 3 so 2 power of x is equal to 3 then in the next step from here this part here is in the form of 2 power of x is equal to 3 is in the form of a power of x is equal to b now by applying the logarithmic rule to find x it will be x is equal to log of b base of a now from this rule here by using this this equation it will be x is equal to log of 3 base of this 2 so this is the final answer for the value of x in this our problem now let's check from this here because in the next step from here we'll apply logarithmic rule like this part here now here into this quadratic equation we'll use discriminant formula to check if it will give a real solution or a complex solution because it must give a real solution so as we can apply logarithmic rule so from discriminant formula which is discriminant is equal to b square minus 4ac then it will be discriminant is equal to b square it will be coefficient of y which is b which is this 4 so it will be 4 square minus 4 times a a is coefficient of y square which is 1 so times 1 times c which is this 12 then it will be discriminant is equal to 4 square it is 16 minus 4 times 12 it is 48 then it will be discriminant is equal to 16 minus 48 here it will be minus 32 now here my discriminant if it is negative value which is less than 0 then from here this quadratic equation there is no real solution so there is no value of x from this quadratic equation now let's check this our answer here of x is equal to log of 3 base of 2 so to check for the value of x is equal to log of 3 base of 2 now from this our problem here which is 8 power of x plus 4 power of x is equal to 36 then from 8 8 is same as 2 power of 3 then bracket this power of x plus 4 is 2 power of 2 then bracket this power of x is equal to 36 then from here we'll exchange the power of x inside power of 3 outside so it will be 2 power of x bracket this power of 3 plus here we'll exchange power of x inside power of 2 outside so it will be 2 power of x bracket power of 2 is equal to 36 then in the next step from here this x and this x will substitute the value of x which is log of 3 base of 2 so it will be 2 power of x which is this here log of 3 base of 2 then bracket this power of 3 plus 2 power of x it will be 2 power of x log x is this log of 3 base of 2 then bracket this power of 2 is it equal to this 36 now from here 2 power of log of 3 base of 2 it is 3 so here it is 3 here inside the bracket same as 3 power of this 3 plus 2 
power of log of 3 base of 2 is same as this 3. So here to be 3, power of this 2 is it equal to this 36. Now 3 power of 3, it is 27, plus 3 power of 2, it is 9, is equal to 36. Because 27 plus 9 is 36, is equal to 36. Now left side and right side are equal, then it is true for the value of x, it is log of 3 base of 2. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.